Hi, everybody. Nick Hussey, CEO at The Manufacturer. It's fantastic to be here today at Smart Factory Expo and to announce and celebrate our partnership with the MTC. Now, someone else who's had a partnership with the MTC is the Paralympian canoeist, Emma Wiggs, who's with me today, and Miguel Fernandez, who worked on the new version of Emma's paddle. So it's fantastic to have you here, guys. Emma, just tell us a little bit about your career and the Olympic medals and things. Yeah, hi, Nick. It's absolutely brilliant to, to be here. So yeah, I've been a para canoeist since 2013. Um, I've got nine world championship titles, uh, two Paralympic gold and one Paralympic silver. So um, not too shabby in a boat, yes, uh, but definitely brilliant. learned a huge amount about manufacturing and innovation and all the exciting things that the clever people do. At the um, MTC. Yeah, at the, the, MTC, guys at the that, MTC. Yeah, that have helped How did us. you first find out about the MTC? Where did that come from? So I was, I was asked to go and do some work with their apprentices ah, uh, okay. from a kind of motivational, inspirational type, yep. type standpoint. And it was from a discussion really with, with one of their um, guys, Richard Watkins, that, that kind Richard, of developed yeah. uh, this interest in whether we could do something to Fantastic. to make a change, to make an impact on, yeah. on how we paddle and, and what we perform. I don't know whether we can show this to the camera, but it's a, it's a pretty amazing looking uh, paddle. And maybe if I could ask Miguel, tell me what it looked like before you got hold of it and what you've managed to do over the period of time you've been working on it. Well, to be honest, I mean, in general, it was very similar to what it is now, uh -huh. but from Emma, we understood what are the specific challenges that she had yep. in there. So we modified, for example, the handle that was in there, the handle that was in there, and as well, like the construction of the paddle itself. So like the, the amount of carbon fiber that it is. So it's all carbon fiber or? Yeah, so all of carbon fiber apart from the from the handle on the top. Okay, I noticed the handle is very interesting. Why has it got that mesh shape? And is, the, is that 3D printed or how has that been constructed? Yes, so that handle on the top is, is 3D printed. So using uh, so high performance uh, polymers yep. and customized to, to Emma's hand. Okay, well. is there a rules that you had to stay within? Maybe Emma or uh, you would know Miguel, the, the certain size things you have to do, a bit like as I do, an F1 car has certain sizes and things. Is it the same with this, or could you did you have free reign to do what you wanted? Well, it really, with you with additive manufacturing, you you have freedom to, to modify in, in yeah. any way. So that we we could, for example, create those lattices that it's are yeah, in there. Lattice so design, we, yeah. Yeah, so we could lightweight the, the handle. Yeah. Emma, what, what, what difference did the paddle make, do you think? Can you, can you feel the difference when you're using it? Was it immediate? Did it take a bit of time? Yeah, absolutely, Nick. I think I'd love to say this was all me, this gold medal, but it, absolu <laughs> it absolutely I'm wasn't. Sure it was, yeah. I think, um, you know, I, I think I had no idea the capabilities of, of what we could achieve right. by collaborating with, with experts. Yeah. You know, I, at the end of the day, I was honestly thinking, just give me a paddle of a different color yeah. and the rest of the world will be wor <laughs> worried because Fantastic. no no one has done it. No one has designed a paddle that is different. So this is a first. This is an absolute first. Yeah. I mean, really? We've always paddled with the paddle that everyone's always used. Yeah. And when I asked yeah. my coach why, you know, as a five foot two female, I use the same handle as that he <laughs> uses, you know, that's or as crazy. a six foot six paddler yeah. would use. I was just told because that's what we've always done. Wow. So it was really innovative and, and it just blew my mind to, to work with the guys and, and come up with the, the 3D printed designs, the the specific, you know, ones that were going to match my needs and my abilities. Um, and it, yeah, from the first time I used it, it felt amazing. It actually allowed us to get a higher stroke rate. I don't want to bore you with, with Whoa, canoeing. Um, seriously. Yeah, I don't, I don't want to bore you with canoeing knowledge, but we were operating, we believed within about, you know, a, a high 103 stroke rate. Yeah. The new paddle has taken us to 115, 118. That's a huge um, difference, actually. Which is a huge difference. 10% difference. When, difference you, when you race over 200 meters. Yeah. Um, and clearly some of that is some of the, the developments that we've made as an athlete. But the paddle yeah. is absolutely uh, fundamental Amazing. to it. So very yeah. exciting. It's a fantastic collaboration. Thank you both for, for spending the time with us today and for coming to Smart Factory Expo. Enjoy the rest of the day and the show. And it's brilliant for us as the manufacturers work so closely with the MTC. So thanks ever so much. Thank you. Guys. Thanks for having me. Cheers.